Our uh, weekly word this week is actually a phrase. It's a continuation of our look at the names of Jesus. And uh, this week's word is Lion of Judah. Jesus is described as the Lion of Judah, and it comes from a couple of different places in the scriptures. You'll get to read those uh, during uh, the week as you read the uh, emails, the verses attached to this email. In uh, the blessing of Jacob on the, his sons at the end of Genesis, uh, to his son Judah, the son through whom Jesus comes, uh, he gives this uh, blessing, that you are a cub, you are a lion cub, O Judah, meaning that he is uh, majestic and powerful and strong. And he gives the promise that uh, Judah will always reign until the one who comes will reign instead, and that is Jesus. And that is confirmed in the book of Revelation, where you'll get a chance to read that this week as well, where Jesus is described as the Lion of Judah, victorious and powerful. The reason that's such a great name for us is for those very reasons, that Jesus is uh, is majestic. You know, I know we talk an awful lot about Jesus as friend and how much he loves us and cares for us, and all of those things are absolutely true, but we can never lose sight of the fact that Jesus is God. He is God. He is powerful. He is mighty. He is majestic. And all of those things lead to uh, what Revelation says, that he is victorious. He is triumphant. He wins. He is a lion, and he is king. He, he wins. And so this week, as you uh, spend time reading those verses, I encourage you to think about the majesty and power of Jesus, and then place that in, in context to how gently he loves us as well. This week, we're going to focus in on the lion of Judah.